Now, why do I prefer editing in CapCut versus InShot when it comes to short form videos? Now, don't get me wrong, InShot is a great app. I actually started with InShot, but later moved on to CapCut for the four reasons why. Number one, CapCut and TikTok integration. Now, all of my videos starts from TikTok and then it gets sprinkled in all of my social media accounts. I mostly edit on the TikTok app and editing features that you see on TikTok actually is the same as CapCut. So there's little to no learning curve when it comes to editing. Number two are pre-made templates that are on CapCut and it's great when you're stuck on a creative rut or some of these templates actually can help your videos go viral. Pro tip, if you want to stay ahead of the curve when it comes to trending songs, transition, then you need to be on TikTok because in two weeks from now, it'll probably show up on Instagram. Number three, if you really want to level up your editing style, there are plenty of online tutorials for CapCut versus InShot. Number four, there are plenty of amazing, great features in CapCut that are for free versus what you can do in InShot, which is very limited and it forces you to buy their yearly or their monthly membership. If you want to take this as a bonus, CapCut recently launched their desktop version, so you don't have to edit on your phone anymore. If you guys have any questions, feel free to... Let me know in the comments. Bye.